Tahoe. Maybe it's some sort of clue. Look. We're dealing with the ghost. Right. I really enjoyed getting to see this series. What I think is so fun about it is that it mixes like these classic kind of literary characters, but oh, then yeah. we get to go yeah. on this adventure with them that's kind of off page. So we're not sure where it's going to go. So dear, maybe um, start off and talk to me a little bit about the concept of the show and how it's helping us fall in love with literature again. Well, I think that I, that's a, such a great question because I think that that's one of my favorite elements about the show is the fact that we're we're telling these classic stories that may have been glossed over or possibly forgotten about by today's youth. And it's so exciting that we get to not only, like you said, tell these tales and pay homage to them, but also be able to kind of give them a new spin, give them a new story, which is really cool. And along that, you know, Princess Matt, maybe talk to me about the idea that while, you know, us collectively with you are going on this huge journey solving these clues, there's also personal journeys taking place for each of your characters. So maybe talk a little bit about maybe the broader theme of justice that we're going to see. Yes, oh, yeah. Nia definitely has some character development going through experiencing racism. And that's a big part of the show mm -hmm. because at first Nia has never been through anything like that. And she not like in a way that she's sheltered, but like in a way that she doesn't even know what to do after and right. doesn't know how to go on from that. But she definitely learned and has grown from that and she became really powerful and used it in a way not to be scared and afraid, but a way to be powerful. And I really love that. You guys only are privy to some of, you know, the visuals that you get to see when, when these characters pop up or some of the fantastical elements that, you know, are, are from the wizard or the ghosts or so forth. So talk about practically shooting. What does that, what does that look like for you mixing in those other mediums? Yeah. So I really like that about the season, how we were the only ones who could see these characters in this yeah, ghost, yeah. releasing these clues. So in the first episode, when we, um when we all meet in the library, we don't know each other. And then here's something, we see something we're like, do you see that? <laughs> like, and it was so cool shooting with that, especially with all the CGI and all the special effects. Oh, yeah. yeah. It was incredible. It was such a nice experience. Shout out How, did you guys get the opportunity to read through the whole thing prior? Do they kind of leave you nuggets and clues along the way, too? What did that look like? Well, <laughs> kind of like, sort of, kind of. Like, we got, like, scripts before, but right. then we got more afterwards. Exactly. So we did get kind of a foundation of where the story was going, but yeah. we still were kind of along for the ride a little bit. Like, our own little mystery. Yeah, we were trying to kind of be like... <gasps> Even, oh, I remember whenever we read the finale for the table. Yes. Oh and we literally all audibly gasped mm -hmm. on the Zoom call like, when it all was revealed. We gasped like jaws on the floor. Like we all no. had our guesses and, you know, like yeah. we had these theories and stuff. And then, like, once we were all on the Zoom call, we all read it at the same time. We looked at each other and we were like, whoa. Yeah, it was just so unexpected. <laughs> so unexpected. So we didn't smart. even, like, we didn't know what was going to happen. Yeah. No spoilers. <laughs> Right, no spoilers. That's mm -hmm. one of the things I think that's so fun is as the clues unfold, you're so interested in this mystery aspect of it, mm -hmm. yet you have the familiar aspect of, of knowing some of these characters from different books and so forth, too. Uh, so I hope that, you know, it can continue on and we can continue to pull out those clues. Yeah. But oh, yeah. good. Well, thank you guys so much for taking the time. I can't wait for audiences to get to go thank on Thank you. Thank you. Thank thank you. Around, you. Around, around the world to watch it. Yes. yes. So excited. October 21st. Have a good one. Bye. 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 Bye.